All right, guys, today we're going to be talking about why NFTs are important and why I'm investing in them and why I believe they're so important. So if that's something that interests you, just stay till the end of the video. It's always a quick video. Always, always, always. But with that being said, guys, let's just jump straight into it. All right, NFTs, non-fungible tokens. Why would they be important? Because we're heading to a new type of lifestyle and that lifestyle is going to be virtual reality, the metaverse. Not necessarily Facebook's, but just that concept of what it is. And as we get comfortable with the metaverse, concept we're gonna want to have less real sh like actual physical stuff imagine if you spend 16 hours a day in this metaverse doing your meetings going to the office having social gatherings going to concerts whatever it is you would want your avatar to have everything you have in real life or what you would want in real life so if you wear a lot of jordan ones you would want the jordan one nfts and those will be coming because nike just expanded a patent same thing with clothing, obviously, or maybe even a car. Honestly, maybe if you haven't seen RDB, you should check that one out there, dropping some NFT cars. But uh, I think that would be quite interesting, I guess you could say, because it's like art or do you drive it in? Anyways, that's a whole different video. But yeah, NFTs are dope. They are our future. But I do believe NFTs have room to come down because we're kind of in a hype cycle right now. And realistically, I don't see NFTs really playing a huge role until like maybe like five to seven years. And then that's when we'll be able to really get into NFTs, you know, because that's pretty much when maybe it's going to start being like a PlayStation or an Xbox for the average household. Meaning if you have an Xbox, you're probably going to have a VR headset for whatever it is. Just my opinion. Now, the one thing about NFTs are everybody's scamming through them right now. And yeah, it's a good way to make money, but I just don't think people really question how long this investment is going to last. Like Bored Apes, I get it. Super dope. But like, then you have like the off branches of the off branch of the off branch of the other off branch. And people are running to them because they want to get early instead of buying like things that matter, like Nike, Disney. You know, Bored Apes is going to be like um, the supreme or babes of um, NFTs, like cause and whatnot. I, I, I really want to see them get into it. But again, we'll see where the future takes us. But there's a lot of junk NFTs. And I think a lot of people are going to be upset when um, this bull market is done because once this bull market is done, the NFTs, are going to be dry, 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 dry because they're so new. It's like when Bitcoin first came out, their cycles were so insane. It was like one cent to a thousand. They were so extreme. The drops were like fucking 80%, 90%. Insane. It was just because it was so new. I believe as time goes on, Bitcoin is going to get less volatile because I believe a huge amount of money is going to be flowing into Bitcoin within five to 10 years, just as a hedge against inflation. It's the new gold, 100% the new gold. But anyways, that's what I think on NFTs. I would love to hear what you guys think. If you have a different uh, perspective on NFTs, I would love to hear it. If you believe they're just scams or JPEGs, well, maybe look into the blockchain. But I look forward to hearing from you guys in the comments. And if you like this type of content, I would appreciate it if you dropped a like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you got to do to stay in the loop. I drop a video about every other day, helping you mentally, physically, financially, spiritually, and emotionally. All here, all for free. All you got to do is subscribe. That's it. But with that being said, my name is Derek with Flip and Drip, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.